Hello and welcome to your two minute real estate roundup. It's the best two minutes in Needham real estate. I'm Rob, this is Ryan, and we are taking a look at the month of Ryan. July, Rob. July is correct. Let's uh, see what we have here, big picture. There were a total of 32 sales, and uh, what other numbers, Ryan? Uh, you, got an, you got an average sale price of just over a million dollars, Rob. Our percentages are very strong. The average days on market are 44. That's pretty good too. The 32 sales, it's a dip from June, it's a dip from last year, but I don't think it's a problem. Well, yeah, this is exciting. How about the average sales price over the course of the last six years? And uh, uh-oh, Ryan, it's dipping a little bit. Should I be concerned? No, you shouldn't, Rob. I think this mix of houses just was on the lower end that we've seen in previous Julys in this case. I don't think it's an example. It's ex indicative of a house that would have been worth more at this time last year. Well, and of the 32 sales, just one new construction. Yeah. Deals of the month. We're going to start with you, Ryan, over on 86 Gay Street. Yeah. Why? I think as I looked at the other sales this month, Rob, this one I looked like a value to me. For 800000 you seem to be getting more than what some of the other homes were offering at similar price points. And I think this is a home that's renovated. It's 2,800 square feet, four beds, two and a half baths in a nice location. Good value at eight hundred grand. All right, my deal of the month is over on 85 Morningside Road. I like the house. I just was really surprised that it landed at 1-3. I thought it was more of a 1-2 house. You know, it had a lot going for it, but I didn't love the basement and the addition. You could kind of tell where it had been added on. And uh, overall, like I said, it just felt like a 1-2 house to me. Market snapshot as we peer into the future, Ryan. How about that number for the listings? Yeah, I and mean, we've been talking about it now for a couple of months. I mean, our, there's not a lot of inventory, but Rob, the sales are consistent. We're still seeing the same amount of closings month over month. We're pacing the same, very similar to how we paced last year in terms of total units. I don't think there's anything to be alarmed about. Also seeing a lot of three bedroom homes selling at 900,000 plus. Gotta That'll watch the whole show for that. That's right. Two minute roundup, thank you. We're out.